Hey, it's J.R. Pandy, the No BS Gardener, and today's topic I want to talk about is snow mold in the yard. With this never-ending snow that we've had this past winter, uh, a lot of my clients are coming in asking, what's all those white, kind of grayish uh, patches in my lawn that just look like they're dead? If you have kind of a, it almost looks like a matted, brown, dead patch, and it can be round or oblong or whatever, and that is snow mold. If you look closely, you can actually see there's some gray to it, which is the actual mold. Now, a lot of people will tell you to uh, put a fungicide on it. This will cure it. It isn't really necessary. The best thing you can do is just get out the old rake and loosen that grass up. And if it's not too bad, if the temperature ever gets warm, the blades are going to grow and your grass, lawn, your lawn is going to be repaired. Now, if you do have a situation where you do have a lot of snow mold, as, as we see over here, we still want to go through and rake it. That's a definite because that just, it allows that air movement to get around those blades. But in this situation, being this bad, you might want to get some grass seed and just throw it around in that area and add some fertilizer. It's coming up to crabgrass preventive season now in the next month or two. And just remember, if you do reseed your lawn and you use a crabgrass preventer, you want to get one that will work with new seed. Otherwise, it can't differentiate from the good and the bad seed, and you'll end up throwing your money away on that desirable seed. Well, that's it for today. I'm J.R. Pandy, and when it comes to gardening, I tell it like it is. 